How to do Boss Rutan's rear naked choke. Hello and welcome to Video Jog. My name is Boss Rutan. Boom, a head butt. Bang, the right elbow. Maybe you know me. The legendary no holds barred fighter. The former Ultimate Fighting Championship heavyweight title holder. You don't want to fight Boss Rutan, but you can fight like him. I'm going to teach you a lesson in mixed martial arts. Pay attention. The rear naked choke, in Brazil they would say mata leo, that means kill the lion. Apparently, the only way to kill a lion is to choke him from the back. I would just use a gun, and that would work too. But hey, if you don't have a gun, maybe you gotta do this. Let's break this thing down in steps. Step one, thin and this. All right, now, we gotta slide a choke in. It's very important that you go underneath his jaw. Make your hand as thin as possible and you start sliding here. Don't try this, no, put it here. Step two, slide all the way through. Once it's here, step three is gonna be grab your biceps from the other hand and this hand is gonna push his head forward. Two reasons, one of them, makes it just way more tighter. And second of all, maybe he's gonna start headbutting back and he can get you. It doesn't really matter because once you get the choke on and you get headbutt, you can still choke him out. But you know, in order to walk around the next day with a thick lip or a big jaw, I would do this. Step four is gonna squeeze everything together and pull your shoulders back and he's going to tap. Bonus tip. If I pull my shoulders back, I'm closing this distance here. This is very important, some people just squeeze. You don't need to squeeze, you don't need any power with this. You're here, and I just pull my shoulders back. And once I pull my shoulders back, it doesn't cost me any energy. You wanna save the energy for maybe when he's gonna escape. You never know what's gonna happen if you have to fight way more, way longer. Okay, this is the rear naked choke. This is a blood choke, as they call it. That means I'm cutting off this artery, and this artery going to the brain in the back. You got two of them too. You cut everything off, and once you squeeze everything together, you flex your bicep. Whoop. He's gonna tap because it's gonna stop the blood circulation to his brain, so he will pass out. Done.